90% of the time, it's just not necessary. You can just close them on the phone. The numbers make sense. They make sense. The first thing is, is just realize that yes, it will be 5% easier in person, right? The main reason that you've been successful to this point is your confidence. So as long as you can bring that along for the, for the virtual sale, I think you're going to do just fine. And I think what, what really you're good at, the reason that you're making sales is the conversation that you're having, right? It is the confidence. It's the conversation. It's, you know, you know, more than enough, more than them. You've got the information advantage and then, and people feel like, you know, what you're talking about. You're a guy who seems to know. And, and that's like the main thing that you want to bring. Now, when it comes, my advice would be, you know, once you get them on the phone, you're really trying to see how far you can move that deal forward. Even if it's, sort of like the first time you're chatting with them and they booked an appointment in the future, your goal should be, how do I, you know, get their usage and bump up that appointment so that it happens today. So that like, we can move them right through the process, you know, make it real easy for them. Um, you know, be very assumptive about them moving forward. Cause you know, it's what nine times out of 10, they're going to be better off for doing it. So I think, the, the big danger I see guys come through, they're like, I don't know how to do this thing without being with them. I do think it might be five or 7% harder, but if you can just show up and be comfortable and be yourself, I think start on the phone and then, um, you know, maybe then you're like, hey, you know, I, I kind of prefer to see a face. Like I'd, I'd rather do this in person, but you're three hours from me. So would you mind? If we uh, just did a little FaceTime, I, I don't want you to think I'm some, you know, stranger in a and <laughs> some uh, terrible place. And I think that's a good way to transition if necessary. But I think 90% of the time, it's just not necessary. You can just close them on the phone. The numbers make sense. They make sense, you know. And yeah. you're not going to be able to do some of the things that you do in person to drive extra rapport. But I think you know what they are and why they work and those types of things. And you'll find little mechanisms to do that over the phone. Even if you're just saying like, yeah, now normally I'd have brought so-and-so thing. So I'm going to, I'm going to just send it to you. Right. Or I'm going to do, I'm going to do it this way. I think people are going to realize who you are and that's, what's going to allow you to make the sale over the phone is the same thing like that they're realizing in person.